Call it hot. <laughs> We're ready to get this one underway. Three two-minute rounds. It's a lightweight, uh, sorry, my apologies. Yeah, lightweight contest. It is lightweight. Seconds out, two, come on, come on, you make some noise. Here we go. Inside. Look how low McFarlane is. When you come in and you can say to yourself, this is the last time I will fight, there's a freedom in that, a true freedom. There's nothing left to and say. And you want to leave the ring with a win. McFarlane covers up. He felt that one, that hard right hand from the kid. Who looks in great shape, by the way, Scott McHugh. Yes, McHugh is, is dropping body down body. to McFarland's level. That's what you want. You want to throw the uppercut underneath. Don't drop down to his. That's oh, a good great shot. fight. That's Wide hands from McHugh. He's, he's showing a big target. So this is what McHugh wants to do now: is in and out. And that's what McFarland wants to do: is scrap it up on the inside. He wants to tear up McFarland. Yep. Yeah, and he's getting one. He's already torn up, speaking of. Left eye already bloodied. Oh, comes under there and then a right. Oh, missed that, with the right. The right to the body, right oh, to good the head by McFarland. That was going to be the, the fight ender, but now it's McHugh landing the big ones. McFarland landed two good ones, and then McHugh landed three. Comes up and under. Two uppercuts and doesn't connect Come with on, either. Let's it up a bit. Either man lands Come those up. uppercuts right there. Real good fight for McFarlane. I don't believe he's winning this round. I think the kid is the winning kids this are round. Tough. I think so as well, just about. But I like the old man's approach. Gritty, hard-nosed, trying to make it a fight for this kid. And I love the kid's approach. Try to make it uh, flashy, try to make it fun, move your feet. He does the jab well, you know, McHugh. He comes with that left jab, which is excellent. He also I, think, I think he shows a lot of target. Oh, there's a hard right hand. McFarlane storming forward, and McHugh lands the straight right hand. McHugh is doing a two oh, right there. Good stuff from McFarlane. Yeah. McFarlane. What McHugh's doing very well is... Oh, an oh, upper clutch and he's yes. caught him. McHugh did well moving forward and backing up. And that was going to be an important aspect of this fight for young Scott McHugh, was to be able to land moving in either direction. I'm sick of saying it, but what a good round, what a good fight. I know, man. Don't ever get sick of saying that. This wow. is what we have a gift being able to sit here and observe these wonderful athletes and artists coming in here and showing their art and their heart. Absolutely, yes, sir. I'm sure McFarlane would have just gone out of that round with just a little bit more confidence because he finished it well. Yes, um, two people, um, two judges for Scott. One, one had it a draw in rounds. I, I probably thought Scott shaded that towards. Just a touch. Yeah, just. But McFarlane finished strong there. He did, yeah, he did, yeah. He's, he's well in the fight. He's, he's come with, um, with him in purpose and stuff. So, yeah, no, it's, it's, that was a really good first round, to be fair. I'm just saying, we're getting, it's almost like we've been paid to say it, but it's like we're sick of saying, what a good fight this is. It's like every time. It's wonderful. Yeah, well, look, look, they're all home fighters, as it were, so they're all our lads, so we want it even fights. You know, well matched. Yeah, exactly. Second out, round two. Second round. And they all want to bring the best out of each other. That's what they're doing. Oh, that's what you want, Scott McHugh. Backing up, landing, moving forward. And quick hands. McFarlane there just smiling at him and almost saying, come on, if that's your best. Scott McHugh's having a great fight so far. McFarlane yeah. is staying in it, and he lands a left hook and comes in behind the straight right to the left hook. When McFarlane is throwing straight right left hook or, or right hook and you left know that hook. left hook, that short left hook, that's a, a devastating punch if it connects. McFarlane's in it. McFarlane's in it. The kid is winning it, but McFarlane's in it. McFarlane's looking for the punch, isn't he? He's, he's showing this kid what old-school uh, bare-knuckle boxing's about. And credit Scott McHugh, he's equal and then he's, some. Yeah, absolutely. McHugh he's is... very light on his feet, McHugh. It's an excellent come experience on, for McHugh to be able to yeah. come in here and get this type of rare test written experience. And a man who won't go away and won't stop moving forward and he lands an uppercut. I don't think he needs to get into a corner and let McFarlane get him in. Oh, McFarlane's saying, is that your best? Come on. He's saying, come on. Well, he's retiring after this fight. He wants everything McHugh will bring him and McHugh will bring everything he's got. That's what McHugh, oh, looking very good. How here, tough is McFarlane, by the way? Oh, God, yeah. Oh, good shot. What a shot from McHugh. So what a shot. What McHugh did was bounce backwards oh, and, and then forward landed, with the left uppercut. And the momentum there, it's all over. That's a knockout. Good shot from Scott McHugh. And actually, McFarlane has a delayed reaction to that shot. The medics are going to treat him, but 
but he is he did lose consciousness after that shot it was a slow collapse or maybe he's, something he's is caught him on the eye he's caught oh. so that we have a good view from here the audience doesn't always need every moment of these views you're these right men you know put when their he, hearts he on the line just hit him, he yeah. used that momentum yeah. to give that power to the punch and so, he caught him an absolute peach so he bounced back and then it's called athletic direction Firstly, let's hope let's hope the medics are, are let's hope he's okay that's the first thing yeah he looks he, he's conscious which is good He's, I believe he's in pain, that's what it is. Yeah. What would happen in that case is... Shock. Yes, in. sometimes, and sometimes it is damage to the orbital bone. It's, it's something we're seeing more and more in combat sports. And what happened was a right uppercut, two knuckles deep, straight up on a piston-like angle. And when that strikes with your head down, it can really, really be a brutal, brutal in impact. So we hope that Sean McFarlane not only is okay, but that he got everything he wanted out of this fight. He wanted it an intense challenge. He wanted a memorable fight. He wanted to be tested right to the limit at 36 or 38 years old from a young kid. And, and I, I hope Scott McHugh is proud that he gave this man the challenge he was looking for. Well, we'll see as uh, he gets his Leeds United flag in the ring. But this is a... this. I mean, Sean's been a great servant to BKB, but McHugh is up and coming. Yeah, he's now two and one. And Sean tonight he's going to back on his feet, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, tonight he was excellent. There is a lot of swelling and already discoloration around the left eye. So, don't be surprised to hear there's some healing time for Sean McFarland. But I hope he is proud of a great career as a combat sports. Absolutely right, spot on. And it's good to see Scott McHugh and him facing up smiling at each other i love that that camaraderie that true warrior well McHugh should be appreciative too not only did this man honor him with his last fight but but mcfarland pushed him and pushed him and kept coming forward and for a kid like scott McHugh, this experience was incredibly valuable it took a really good punch to put him down and it was a good punch yeah. bounce back and and a, and a pure clean expression of a right uppercut direction change with his feet and his nervous system and he drilled it in from the head ladies and gentlemen a massive over both warriors there your winner by third round knockout scott the mute McHugh. yeah the, the swelling around that eye is irregular that quick